Hello, my name is Dustin and in this tutorial I will show you how to understand the shotlist section and what you can do here. As you can see we have created a ready-made shotlist here and now you have the ability to go into the scenes and change the name and all kinds of information. For example you can change day to night. You can also do the same thing in the shots. There you can simply add or delete the relevant information and you can also change certain properties in the shot columns such as shot size or perspective. You have a lot of options to make your shots look the way you want them to. You can also use the plus and minus icons to add or delete shots. For example, if you don't like a shot, you can simply delete it. You can also add shots at any time. If you click on the plus, the shot will be duplicated and you will have the same shot down here again, so you can make changes to it. You can also drag and drop your shots around you can move shots within a scene, but you can also move shots between scenes. As you can see, the AI has already recognized characters, in this case Max and Maria, and I'll explain how to understand characters and what you can do with them in another tutorial. You also have the Add Character icon in the top right corner, which means you can also add characters. And there is a separate tutorial for that as well. This is basically an overview of your shotlist section and what you can do there. Familiarize yourself with what the AI has suggested and change it to your liking at any time. If you want to learn more about characters, check out the other tutorials.